Hi there, it's Debbie from My Vagabond Style, and I am here today to bring you the Marguerite Miller Collage Weekly Planner Challenge, and we are doing week number 12. So, uh, <laughs> this is a big stretch for me. Um, I'm going to try something, I've done it on a small scale, and this is uh, something that uh, Dee Dee Willingham is her channel name and her name. She does these art card collages that are amazing. And uh, about 2016, I tried to do what she does. And <laughs> these are my attempts of trying it. And so anyway, this you just put the elements down. This one is not finished and then you just kind of collage around them and then after you're done you put a lacquer on the top and this one has the lacquer on it and then they get real thick by the time you put all your elements on there and your paint so I'm gonna try it today with you guys these are I'm just gonna show you a few of the ones that I, I have done or are still in work. This one, again, doesn't have any of the uh, lacquer on the top of it yet, or this one. Um, yeah, so <laughs> I also enjoy space and time elements like she does. So I have been doing these, like I said, for a few years. 2016, I think, was the last time I picked it up. So anyway, we're going to try it with our prompts this time. And uh, here's what I came up with. So what I went ahead and did was when I, when I did all these, I actually put the prompts on and then painted around them. This one I wanted to have, and I've seen her do it this way before where she put, she goes over a base. So this one again is another Olympus watch ad that I think is really cool and so we're starting with that as the base and that is um, going to be my uh, the, well the prompts are something found in a treasure chest so that I went with like jewels so we're going to try to work these in um, and I have enough, more jewels <laughs> graph paper which I found this little scrap here that is graph paper that I somehow will work in and uh, let's see a hand tool I did not do the hand tool a piece of scrap art uh, let's see oh wait sorry this one is not ready yet a piece of scrap art something you see through a window so that's where I went with this because you would be like you see space and stars so there I've got that and then a key we're gonna work this guy in here or woman I'm not sure <laughs> um, there's a piece of jewelry here and then there's a key hanging down so I'm not sure you can see that it's pretty small, but it's there. Trust me. <laughs> so let me see one, two. The only thing I don't seem to have is scrap art, a piece of scrap art. And this was from something I was going to do before. So I'm going to call that my scrap art. And she uses golden matte medium, which I have here to put everything down. Oh, I know what the other thing, there's one thing missing, sorry. I'm gonna put this in there too. We're gonna have that in there because that's something you would see out your window. <laughs> Maybe, it's a satellite. I'm gonna call it a satellite. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna go here and I am probably gonna have a lot of this on fast forward because this is not a quick process. This is probably going to take me, I don't know, two or three hours. So uh, with that, enjoy the music and watch the process.
Okay, so I got it all laid down here and used the golden matte medium, which she says is very important because if you want to take any of the paint off, if you make a mistake, you can wipe it off with a baby wipe. So that's why we're using the golden matte medium. And I've got my brush and some water here. And we'll see where it goes from here. Back the camera out just a little bit. I feel like you're not getting the whole thing here. Okay. And there will be a few wrinkles. Um, I have some magazine pages in here that are like from a fashion magazine and those don't do so well. Um, the thicker, the nicer quality paper, the better for this. But that's the images I found, so I went with it. Also, she says if you tear the paper, rather than having these straight lines, when you go to blend it in, it blends in a whole lot better if it's ripped. So I tried to rip it in some spots. Other spots I really couldn't because of where I wanted it positioned. So right now it's going to dry, and then I will be back to paint it. So hold on just a minute.
Okay, so here I'm just trying to match the colors as best that I can. Uh, when I've watched Dee Dee do it, she doesn't really rinse her brush out very much, so I'm just kind of going along with that and just trying to blend the colors as best I can to match. And just trying to make some of these harsh edges soften. So that's what I'm doing right now. So here I'm just still trying to figure out how all these elements can come together. Uh, it's quite a process to figure it all out. I feel a little lost at this point, so I'm just trying to keep mixing the colors, make everything kind of blend together. 
and I'm also trying to put in like an element that looks like a little bit of water coming down off that necklace and into the ring. And I'm also thinking I probably should have watched about three or four of Dee's videos before I attempted this because I obviously forgot some of the skills that I had learned in 2016, but I'm mumbling through it. It's just so different than everything that I've been working on for the past few years. So it's, you know, it is good to get out of your comfort box, your comfort zone and into an uncomfortable position because it really does just make you grow. I also keep stopping and starting the music because you only get like a couple minutes of music when you download a mu some music from wherever. And uh, so I'm just trying to stretch it out here and not make it boring for you guys, but um, it does take a long time to do these. And it is a labor of love because it is, it's a lot of fun. I've never done it while I've been recording anything. And I did feel a little bit pressured from that. And which is silly because if this didn't come out, I could just delete this recording and try something else. But um, I'm just going to show you whatever it turns out like. Okay, I think I'm done. Other than putting the lacquer on it, uh, I think I'm done. And <laughs> boy, this was not easy. Doing the art cards because they're smaller seemed to be a little easier for me. But um, I know it's different. I hope you like it. Uh, if Dee Dee ever saw this, she'd probably go, girl, did I teach you anything? Well, I had fun doing it, so uh, I guess that is the ultimate goal. So thank you so much for watching, and check on some of the other gals that have been doing this it, using the hashtag 2023CWP and see what everybody else is up to. I really appreciate you watching, and I will see you next time. Thanks so much. Bye.